putting in uh, a background into a Word document, whether it be a multi-page document that you want all the pages uh, to look the same, say with a border or a logo or some kind of header and footer, um, or what it's really good for is creating letterhead layouts for your clients. So uh, you put in a background that maybe has a logo and a footer and a dress bar, um, all designed exactly how you want it uh, alongside with their style guide and and things like that so that it looks the way you want to in Word because we always know that that's a challenge in getting things to look graphically great in Word. So this is an easy way to do it. So uh, what you want to do is design your background. So this is the background that I want to use throughout my document and I'm going to export it as a high-res JPEG. I'm just going to save that onto my desktop and I'm going to choose high here and 300 dpi so that it prints really nicely so I'm just going to export that and once that done, that's done I'm going to go back into Word and I'm going to have a new document and I'm going to change the uh, orientation to landscape to fit my design that I just created and then I'm going to insert a watermark so this brings up a little dialog box here with all of this text in there and it's just going to show you how your watermark is going to look. It's sort of a preview pane. So we want to click picture. We want to select the picture that we just exported. So there it is it's put in there and we don't see anything yet because it's washed out and it's very faded. So we want to tick this off. So it just appeared this teeny weeny little background here. Um, what the washout does is uh, true to watermark, the word watermark, it would wash it back so that it was just a hint of the image behind the graphics and text that we're going to put in. But we don't want that. We want it to show up um, exactly the amount of color that we that we designed it in in, in InDesign or uh, Illustrator. So the key thing here is you want to scale it to 100% so that it is exactly the size uh, that we exported it in our graphical program. So here we go. Oh, there it goes. And it fits the whole page, which is exactly what we want. Then you simply click OK. And there you have it in the background and we can type words in here and um, that will be locked down just like a header or footer um, it actually I think it actually is in the header and footer uh, sort of place in, in Word but um, you, you set it up this way so that you don't have to worry about sizing it or moving it around so there it is simple as can be good luck